WSWOLP Oldies 97.3 is a non-commercial low-power FM station at 97.3 MHz licensed to Southwestern Ohio Public Radio Incorporated In Huber Heights, Ohio. The station originally signed on as Waxer LP in September 2004, switching to its current calls in January 2005. The WSWO calls were previously used in Wilmington, Ohio at 102. 3 FM. From 1968 to 1972, the WSWO calls were used by Independent Channel 26 out of Springfield, Ohio. WSWO LP is a non-commercial radio station relying solely on donations from listeners and local businesses to cover expenses for daily operations and music royalties. Accordingly, all persons involved in the station's programming and maintenance are unpaid volunteers. The station's format consists of oldies music, but also airs syndicated and locally produced programs devoted to different genres of oldies, including pre-rock and roll era music. The station also prominently features coverage of Wayne High School sports, and occasionally broadcasts locally produced radio dramas, including a dramatized version of A Christmas Carol, which features several members of the air staff in the cast and has been an annual holiday presentation since it first aired in 2011. Though non-commercial, the station broadcasts acknowledgments of local businesses who support the station, added to which community announcements are aired along with PAM-style jingles for identification purposes. WSWOLP operates with a power of 100 watts. Its original transmitter was located on Lisa Drive. The station later moved its studios and transmitter to the Huber Center, a shopping center at the intersection of Brant Pike and Chambersburg Road, with the station's transmitter located behind the building. The station originally used translator W268 acts at 101. 5 MHz from Old Troy Pike in North Dayton with a power of 106 watts which provided a wider coverage area reaching downtown Dayton, Moraine, Troy, and the fringe areas in Piqua to the north and Miamisburg to the south. The transition from 101. 5 to 101. 1 took place on Monday, August 11, 2008. Both FMs served the area of North Dayton, Vandalia, Englewood and surrounding communities. According to its website, the station's translator moved from 101. 5 to 101. 1 in August 2008 when the former WKSW Kiss Country moved from 101. 7 to the 101. 5 frequency and switched its city of license from Urbana to Enon. The WSWOLP translator was granted by the FCC earlier in the summer to move to 101. 1 under the new call sign W266BG. As of September 2013, the 101. One translator is no longer in use by the station. It is now being used by WZLR. Also WCWT in Centerville has been granted a construction permit to move to 107. 3 MHz to accommodate the WKSW slash WCLI move to 101. 5 MHz. This move allowed better reception in the southern portion of Dayton as well as the Beaver Creek area. WSWOLP's original frequency was located adjacent to 97. 5 the 97. 5 frequency was previously licensed in the Dayton area and was used in the 1950s for the fledgling but short-lived WLWB-FM, owned by Cincinnati-based Crosley Radio. Moved to 97. 5 a construction permit was granted by the FCC on November 23, 2011 to move WSWOLP from 97. 7 to 97. 5. On-air testing began on November 30th from the new transmitter site located at the WSWO office and studio location. The move was meant to help resolve coverage problems, notably interference from Waxy which was formerly located in Oxford and is now in Mason. The official switchover from 97. 7 to 97. 5 took place on Saturday, December 3, 2011. 97. 7 is now unused in Dayton. On January 25, 2013, WSWOLP began streaming online at their new domain, www.daytonoldies.org moved to 97. 3 until October 4, 2013, WSWOLP operated on the 97. 5 frequency. On October 4, 2013, WSWOLP moved to 97. 3 FM, giving the station the ability to upgrade its signal and transmit from a higher tower. With the move, the station no longer needed the W266BG translator at 101. 1 FM, which is owned by a separate entity, the translator is now being used by WZLR. 
The FCC frequency was licensed by the FCC on December 12, 2013. Thanks for watching.